Story at 530. The first transportation plan in more than a quarter century is now official and it should kick in this summer. The multi-billion dollar plan will help pay for some big projects here in Hampton Roads, from fixing potholes to widening interstates. There are still a few more hurdles, though, to jump before the work gets started. 10 on your sides, Lauren Compton is live in Portsmouth with what has to happen next. Lauren. Anita, before any road projects get underway, a lot of big decisions have to be made. Local transportation officials have to decide how all of this money from the transportation bill will be used and which projects will be funded. But we'll all start feeling the effects of this new law in our wallets very soon. Starting July 1, the flat gas tax is gone. Instead, you will pay 1% more in sales tax because of this new transportation law. The average family will pay about $10 to $20 more a month in sales tax. The money will be used to fund road improvements and interstate projects. It will also help deal with the pothole problems we've all dealt with at some point or another. It can certainly stop the degradation of the infrastructure that we've seen during the past five years of pavement going bad and infrastructure around those roadways uh, going bad. The state has a list of road projects, bridge, tunnel, and interstate work that needs repair or improvement. They have placed a higher priority on big ticket items like work on I-64. The I-64 interstate widening on the peninsula, some sort of a crossing between peninsula and south side, south side to peninsula. The interchange at I-64, 264 at the Norfolk, Virginia Beach line. There are also more than 100 city and county road projects on the list. But before any construction gets underway, the Hampton Roads Transportation Planning Organization has to decide which of the road projects will receive funding in our area first. It'll be based in part on affordability, uh, bang for the buck, cost effectiveness. Now, there will be a series of public comment uh, sessions to get your input on these things, and members of the Hampton Roads Planning Transportation Organization will have to finalize their plans in June. Now, we have a list of the city and county road projects on wavy.com. Reporting live in Portsmouth, Lauren Compton, 10 on your side. Thank you, Lauren. Today